Lion Songs, Episode 1, Silence. I made it just before the rain. Hopefully it will stop soon. The walk up here was exhausting. Whew. All right, Wilma, it's time to unpack your bag. Okay, where's your bag? My bag! I'm starving. There should be a sandwich in here. Okay. My music paper. Oh, here it is. That's a sandwich. Oh, a letter. Who is it from? It says, open upon arrival. So it's from Archer. My dear Wilma. I hope you have a trouble-free journey. I'm sure you have started writing already. Nah. Inspired by the beautiful surroundings. Where it's raining outside. Read on. However, I have a confession to make. This is where I buried the bodies of my former students. Perhaps he... Perhaps he has written something about us. You crazy? Before your departure, I started to organize a concert at the Music Verin in Vienna. Mus music Verin? V Ver Verin? I, I don't know. M music Verin. I was able to convince a few illustrious colleagues to offer their works. I had to call in many favors, but... Mr... Oh my god. Mr. Schongberg, Mr. Berg, and Mr. Mahler... I hope I said that right. Have you have all agreed to participate? It will be a glorious evening. Glad you're not here. And your composition will be the centerpiece. She's so sad. The grand finale. Wilma, imagine it. You'll have to imagine it because you're not here because I made sure to send you away first. I understand that this is all very abrupt. And for that, I'll, I apologize. But now is your time. The musicians start rehearsal next week. The piece must be ready by then. I get the feeling that Archer is like stealing work from his students. He's like trying to steal her music maybe because he's having this big representation with her music as the big thing and she's not there because he sent her away. In anticipation of your return, Archer. A concert? One week? How is this less pressure? Archer, how could you? The storm is almost here. How am I supposed to write something if I can't go outside? I am trapped here. With a storm outside. And within me, silence. Uh, start by eating your sandwich. I lost my appetite. Just eat your sandwich! Damn it. Ugh! Hello? Shetemnegdo? Excuse me? Oh, German! Yes? I guess we're speaking German. Um... Who is this? I, um... Well... My name is Leos. Okay. Are you still there? Yes. Amazing. I wonder if you are close by. Where are you? What the fuck? You don't know where you're calling? Yeah, yeah, I, I agree with her face. Um, where are you calling from? I am in southern Bohemia. And you, madam? I'm far away. Leos, I assure you, I am long away, a long way away. Ha ha ha! I never would have dreamed of this. 
I was told you can speak over long distances, but to actually hear a voice. It's amazing. I guess it's his first phone. I can, not, I can now finally talk to my niece, Nicole. What was that? What was what? <laughs> that noise just now. Wasn't that you? I hear the noise every day. When my guests come to me with empty bellies. Are you an innkeeper, Leos? I am. Best dumplings in all of Bohemia. Wonderful when they're fresh out of the pot. With a rich, hearty sauce. When you cut into one and the steam comes out. Uh, yeah. That sounds delicious. They are delicious. You have to come by one day so I can cook some for you. I wish I had some here right now. Of course you wish that. <laughs> oh ho ho. I apologize. It sounds like you are very hungry. It was a pleasure talking to you, madam. Uh, uh, I'm very sorry. Where are my manners? I didn't even ask your name. Well, he did tell us his name. It's Wilma. Wilma? Wilma. It was a pleasure speaking with you. Why are you saying it like that? Wilma? Say, so do you think we could talk again sometime soon? They gave me a number. 1255. Maybe. I hope so. Okay, um... I want to be polite, but at the same time it was kind of weird. But I guess it's his first phone, so I guess he's not a stalker or anything. Um... Thank you for your call. Goodbye, Wilma. Okay, eat the sandwich. Time for my sandwich. Yes, eat the sandwich. <laughs> nom, 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 nom. <laughs> okay. It may not be a dumpling, but it tastes delicious. I'm so tired. It was just too much for my first day. I wonder if something would have happened differently if I chose different answers. Outside behind the building, the sun is rising. Besides Wilma, someone stirs. What? What the fuck? Archer, what? what? So they sleep together? So he's sleeping with his student? What the fuck? Wilma? Hey, are you awake? No, fuck you. It's late. How did we get here? I was just... I have to leave. Something's wrong. Wait, Archer, something's wrong. I mean... This is what I wanted, but... I really have to go. This is a dream, isn't it? I'm expected at the Institute. <laughs> but it's your Institute! Yes. Yes, and you are my student. We should not be together in the first place. Is that what we are? Together. Distant church bell chimed the hour. Six o'clock. I am already late. What could be so urgent? Today is meeting. Schongberg's contribution. 
I have to be there. It will be marvelous! Archer, we should talk. What? Imagine the look on their faces when your song is played. Why is... Is he holding her like she can't get away now? What are you doing? Imagine where you could be in a year. Stop your hurting me! He's really crushing her. The future of music! No! Ow! Archer! No! Just stab him in the eye!